Let's make some maple brown sugar oatmeal muffins. Yum! To a container, you're going to add in two cups of rolled oats and one cup of milk and mix that all together and let it sit for like 15 minutes or so. To that same container, I'm just going to add in the half a cup of maple syrup as well um, and mix that together so that the oats start getting a little more maple flavored. To a large bowl, you are going to add in a third of a cup of oil. I used coconut um, and then two thirds cup of brown sugar and two large eggs and I'm going to whisk that together before adding all of this yummy goodness. That's all mixed together and now we are going to add in that yum. Mm. If you want to, you don't have to, but you can add in two teaspoons of vanilla and if you have maple flavoring, add in maple flavoring. I'm doing um, two teaspoons of vanilla and a half a teaspoon of almond flavoring. Uh, because there's already maple flavoring in there from the maple syrup. And I don't know why I'm using a knife. It's what I have, so what I, why not? Preheat your oven to 375 right now as well. To the bowl, you are going to add in one and a half cups of all-purpose flour, one teaspoon of baking powder, half a teaspoon of baking soda, one and a half teaspoons of cinnamon, because you know I love my cinnamon, and about three-fourths teaspoon of salt, and mix that all together. Okay, now that it's all mixed together, you are just going to put it in your large tin that has, I don't know, rough spots on it, but I greased it and that's what we're gonna use, baby. All right, sprinkled with a little bit of sugar and now we're gonna put them in at 375 for about 10 minutes and then rotate them and then probably another five or 10 more minutes or so. Okay, they needed way more time, but they look good and my husband already stole one. So let's see how they turned out. Just at the tire shop to finish this video. Um, muffins tasted really good. I was very happy with them. Uh, I took them to my best friend's wedding and I think they got eaten. I'm not 100% sure, but I ate some and that's good enough for me and my husband loved them. I would definitely add more cinnamon next time and maybe some nutmeg or something, um, like a brown sugar topping. Otherwise, they were delicious and, oh, and maple flavoring. I wish I would have had maple flavoring to go along with the maple syrup just to add a little oomph to it. So hope you guys enjoy. Have a good night.